amen to that. And now the moment all the Gleeks and Levotics have been waiting for. We love the series Glee for so many reasons. The amazing music, the intense drama, the dry cleaning bills from all those slushies getting thrown around. But the impact of the characters, and one character in particular, stays with us to this day. Here to kick off a remembrance and a celebration is actor, recording artist, and LGBTQ rights activist, my girl, Demi Lovato. Hi, my loves. I really wanted to be here tonight to thank everyone in the LGBTQ community for standing up this year to insist on change through our voices and through our votes. I don't have to tell you that this year was a tough, tough year. A particular moment of heartbreak stands out for me losing my friend Naya Rivera. I will always cherish the chance I got to play Naya's girlfriend, Danny, on Glee. The character Naya played, Santana Lopez, was groundbreaking for closeted queer girls like I was at the time. And her ambition and accomplishments inspired Latina women all over the world. That's the power of a show like Glee. And LGBTQ youth, you have power too. Follow GLAAD now and get involved in activism. Let's use our power to move the Equality Act forward. It's been 10 years since Santana Lopez came out. Look at what LGBTQ teens have done in a decade. Imagine what we can do in the next one. Some friends of mine got together so they could remember Naya and remind you, don't stop believing. Here's the cast of Glee. What's up, party people? Hi, so nice to see you all. Hi, everybody. Hello. I miss you so much. My old I miss you guys. I love you. Everyone looks so good. Oh my God. You do too. You all look great. You haven't aged a day. Now you have to say the same thing to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this year has been hard and challenging in so many ways. There's been so much loss. Over 500,000 Americans from COVID. So many friends and icons from the LGBTQ community. There was one particular loss that hit us so incredibly hard when we lost our dear friend, Naya Rivera. I was always in awe of how talented she was. There, there was always just so much more than met the eye with Naya. I remember when Naya became a regular cast member. She was a dancer, and I always thought she was cute, and she was a great dancer. And then Brian started giving her lines, and I was like, wow. This girl is really something. I remember getting to work one day and she was performing Nutbush City Limits. Do you remember that, Jenna? Yes. <laughs> and I just, I think that was the first time I had seen her live perform and you could not take your eyes off of her. She quite literally turned that song out. It was, my reactions that you see in that scene are very true, very honest, very like in the moment because I was just so floored about the power and prowess that she had. When Naya passed and all these messages came in over social media, the messages were sort of all the same. She would treat you how she treated me, someone that she knew and saw every single day or how she treated her family. She made everybody laugh like on screen and off, but like the real win was if you made her laugh because you knew you actually did something really funny. <laughs> That's so true. Nye and I were good friends on the show, but I think we became um, much better friends when we both had children. And to see her put all that energy into her son was just uh, an incredible sight to see and something I'll always remember. Her best role was her being a mom. That was the most fulfilling to see her do that. And you know, Naya even hosted this very show, the Glad Media Awards, twice once on her own. I find it really empowering for teenagers especially that they can see themselves on a show like Glee. And once with our beloved Corey. This year marks the 10th anniversary that Naya's character Santana Lopez came out on Glee. Santana basically got disowned by her family and as a lot of us know that's a feeling too many LGBTQ kids know too well. The character of Santana Lopez was so important. With the exception of our show, there were almost no LGBTQ teens on television at the time. Especially young Latina LGBTQ women. And as an ally, Naya was so honored to represent them. That scene when Santana came out to her grandmother. I love girls. And was rejected. 
Oh, boy, you, oh. you don't now. I'm the same person I was a minute ago. It still, it still makes me cry. But things are getting better uh, because every year there's more LGBTQ representation on TV and more diverse representation, which leads to more acceptance and more kindness. We are so very proud to be part of that trajectory and we're very proud to honor our incredible friend, Naya Rivera tonight. Naya's mother wasn't able to join us tonight, but she did want to share these words. Naya would be honored to receive this recognition. When Naya was told that Santana would be a lesbian, she called me to let me know. And I asked her how did she feel about that, and she said, I feel great about it. Little did we know that she would impact so many people in the LGBTQ community. Her desire was to always be an advocate to those who did not have a voice. I don't believe that she realized how important she was to this world. I am grateful that my eldest daughter helped to change the landscape of how we view and see each other. Thank you, Glad, for keeping my daughter's legacy alive. Glee won the Glad Media Award for Outstanding Comedy Series twice. And tonight, we get to pass the baton. <laughs> pass the baton. Oh, come on, Matt. There's no baton. Love it, Matt. What about the Glee trophy? Still corny, Mr. Shoe. It, okay, whatever you want to pass, let's pass <laughs> it to this new winner, all right? Let's go. Here are the nominees for Outstanding Comedy Series. Big Mouth. I found this forum for trans kids, and it was like, that's who I am. So I told my parents. Oh, God. Dead to me. And you're just friends. Oh, just friends, yeah. Because you're not. Uh, not with her. Everything's going to be okay. Okay, fine. Yeah, 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 yeah. Harley Quinn. I love you, I I love you too, Harles. I love Victor. And have you even said the words out loud yet? I'm gay. I'm going to. Saved by the bell. It's like I've been going to school with these people for years, and this is the first time they're going to see me since my transition. The first time they're actually going to see me as myself. Shit's Creek. David. David, do you take Patrick to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. Sex education. Shit, no people. I don't care. Superstore. Sorry to interrupt. I was wondering if you wanted to dance. 20s. All right, I'm just stressed about work. That's exactly why I'm trying to take your ass away for the weekend. And the 2021 Glad Media Award for Outstanding Comedy Series goes Rip to... Rip it open! Come on, Jenna! Come on! Jenna. Let's go, Jenna. Come on, time is money, girl. Shit's Creek! <laughs> Woo!